feel like this is your best practice today? Uh, no, no. My one-on-ones weren't, weren't great in terms of getting my hands on receivers. I made a good play with Dez, but the three reps before that, um, I got to work on that. Yeah, but when Dez comes back, though, and gives you, you know, gives you a little hug after that play, that has to make you feel pretty good, though. Yeah, it's great. It's great to get the respect from the older guys. Just got to keep this up. Try to keep going in the right direction. How different is this kind of camp to what you had at UConn? Um, high intensity. Obviously, you can see there's 10,000 fans here watching you. They're yelling at you if you, met, if you mess up a play, if you drop a ball. Um, so the intensity level is a lot higher. Uh, the expectations are a lot higher as well. And, and the work, too, on the field, is it more or less? I, mean, I say a lot more. You know, yeah. Coach Rod forces you to run to, to the ball regardless if it's complete or incomplete. If it's incomplete, you scoop the ball up and run for five yards, no exceptions. He doesn't let that crap slide. <laughs> is, is it hard knowing, not knowing if I'm if you're here, corner, if you're in the slot? If, I mean, is, is it difficult? Figuring out what you're doing mostly today. Honestly, it's exciting. It's cool because yeah. whatever I feel like, anytime they throw me around, I feel like they're challenging me. Let's say I feel like they're saying, "Hey, bro, let's see what you got. Can you play nickel? Can you play dime? Can you play safety? Can you play corner? All in one practice." So I, I accept the challenge. I like those. So.